from WROC. This is News 8 at 11. Good evening and thank you for staying with us for this late edition of News 8 at 11. The search continues tonight for missing RIT student George Delaney. He was last seen more than a week ago in Wayland. Since then, state police have searched the area where witnesses last saw his car. This is video of those teams. Today, classmates and one of Delaney's professors used a different method to try and find him. News 8's Alex Hinckley has the story. George Delaney's 21 years old. That makes him too old for an Amber Alert or a spot in the national database for missing and exploited children. That's why his classmates and professor have taken it upon themselves to get the word out. I'm calling on Sunday, March 20th to ask for your help to find missing RIT student George Delaney. Paloma Capana is reaching out to everyone she knows. Your help may make the critical difference. She's Delaney's professor at RIT. Nobody's heard from him in more than a week, and she's worried because crucial time is ticking away. George is not someone I would think would just walk away. He's great, right? He's a student who's always in class, prepared, and very much on topic. Saturday, she teamed up with students and went to Wayland, where Delaney was last seen. We met with um, local individuals, uh, businesses in the community, to try to distribute flyers and create awareness. They are concerned. They are ready, willing, and able to help. And as soon as they saw the flyer in our hands, their hands went straight out. They wanted to do something to help George. <laughs> Sunday, the team worked from home stuffing envelopes, making calls, and sending emails. They're using social media, too. There's a lot of worth to using things like Facebook now um, to get in contact with people. More than 300 people have joined the Students Finding George Delaney page. They say they won't stop searching until Delaney is found. We would like the community to just you know, not forget the issue, not forget George. Um, keep thinking about him, thinking about his family and help in any way you can. You have to be George's Amber Alert. Capana told me that after Delaney is found, she wants to help start a database for missing young adults. She said the biggest frustration about her student's disappearance is that there is no alert system. Friends and family are forced to rely on only word of mouth. Alex Hinckley, News 8.